Hello everyone, you're on to Healthy Options with Maureen. Today we'll be making some onion and oba sauce. The good thing about this sauce is that you can make it happen in a question of minutes. As long as you have some onions at home and some oba, oba is also known as the African oil beans, then this recipe can come together in a very short time. Come with me as we make this, I know you will like this. If you do, don't forget to subscribe by hitting on the red button. I'll also be leaving a link below at the description so that you can check out other yam recipes and other sauces you can have with yam. Thank you. So for our onion and oba sauce, we'll be needing some palm oil, some onions, oba, a little bit of crayfish, some salt, and some scotch bonnet peppers. So I have my pot right here and I'll be adding on the palm oil onto it. So the palm oil goes in and I'll be placing this on heat right now. So I'm just going to allow this melt. And once it melts completely, I'll be adding on my onions. So as you can see, it's completely melted and the onions goes in immediately. I'm going to give it a good stir and I'm cooking on the medium heat and the next thing that will be going in will be the salt the salt goes in then the scotch bonnet peppers go in as well so I'm going to stir fry this until it begins to caramelize as you can see it's beginning to caramelize so right now I'll be adding on the crayfish the crayfish goes in and I give it a good stir. I'll cook for that for an extra minute before adding on the owa or the African oil bean. So after about a minute of adding on the crayfish, your owa goes in. You give it a good stir. So right now we're adding on just very little water just for the owa to cook through. I'll cover the pot and let it steam. Allow the water to dry up and let the owa soften. Then I'll come back and show you how I serve this. So that is what it looks like by the time it's completely cooked. I'm going to turn off my heat now and I will show you how I serve this. So this is how I will serve my oba sauce with some boiled yam. I hope you give this recipe a go and let us know what your take is on it. Please if you've not subscribed, don't forget to do so by clicking on the red button. Thank you.